three, two, one, go. Hello, I am Slow Bullet, and I am the host of your favorite online show every annual year, CE3, also known as Custom Edition Entertainment Expo. And I'm here with my friends, who are... I'm Matthew Dra. I'm the co-host and editor. I'm M16 Assault, the animator. Yes, and we're all here to tell you that CE3 2013 is a go. Okay. But no, we are here um, to say that we are actually accepting you to say that you are interested for CE3 2013. Uh, we have a new stage this year for 2013, which is way better than last year's stage, because honestly, we all know you hated last year's stage, but it was better than the years before stage, but still the stage sucked. But no, 2013 actually sounds like a good year for us. The stage is being made by Renegade343, and also new to C3, we have a visual design artist, that's Kozaku, or he's, he's just going to be helping me with a lot of the editing, essentially. That means more explosions. Well, not really. Well, kind of, but yeah, it's going to be awesome. Definitely more awesome. Also, what we have this year is a lot more cool entries, too, if you think about it. Think about everything that was released after CE3 this year, like we had... Z Team's release, CMT saying stuff. It's all cool stuff this year, what we're going to have. Not saying we have any of that yet. <laughs> well, we don't have it, but I'm going to get it. I'm going to talk to Masters again. I know Masters didn't show up last year, but Masters, if you're watching this, I'm coming after you, and I'm going to find a way. But anyway, so yeah, what we are doing right now is basically taking... We're just telling you that CE3 is still alive. It is a go. Um, we'll do it sometime in July, like we usually do in 2013. I believe maybe around like somewhere between the 10th to the 20th, which we usually do, depending on which day follows a Saturday. This year we probably will do it on Sunday or Saturday. I forget which one again still. We'll just figure it out. We're, for that we are not sure yet exactly what yeah. we're doing. We'll have another poll like we did for 2012. Yeah, but that's not for a while wise because it's still December, but we still like to get ready. We like to know if you're interested. We like to know because we realize that it takes a while for you guys to make maps and you'll be like, all right, let, let me make our map. And we'll be like, all right, we'll let your map come in, your tags. Remember, this is not just maps. This is anything Halo CE related. So, the rules. Uh, you can visit the website haloc3.co.nr, and you can find just a list of rules and formats if you're confused about what to submit. Yes, and if It's you, all on the website. Also, if you've never seen it, please check out our YouTube and watch last year's and all that. It's actually quite entertaining to watch just the show and what we do. It just kind of shows you like what goes on. Because I know people every year always ask, well, what's CE3? Like, what is it? And then I like send them the video, and they're like, wow, that's actually quite and cool. And then they like it. So please watch that before you come to me and ask, like, what all it is. Please go watch the YouTube video, watch, read the rules. Just kind of look around CE3. We'll, we'll have all the links in the comments so you can see it. And, of course, we'll have uh, the link to our forum page about CE3 2013. But, no, that's really all I can think of, honestly. Well, then, uh, do you want to talk about uh, Halo CE videos, the new portion to Halo maps? I submitted C3 2012 to there, so... <laughs> oh, you did? Yeah, it's Hi. at the very bottom right now. Oh, that's Wait a minute. upsetting. Is for the Halo map? Uh, this is actually quite interesting. Wow. I, I think we should get our own CE3 section. <laughs> that's I think cool. we should. Alright, this is actually a comment to you all. Let's pull and, and talk to Dennis that we need CE3 on the Halo Maps site due to its majority of everyone liking CE3. Memoria has its own section. CMT has its own section. Just just make a little CE3 section. Yeah, like, because that way people can actually like see like what happened in CE3 last year. Like Everyone loves to see things. That's what it is. People go to CE3 because they love to see things. They like eye candy. Because I, every year, I'm going to say this right now, I always try to get Dennis to do something yeah. for CE3. We always try to get him on. He always, he never does it. Like, the first year we did it, um, Drat got banned, and and one of and the CE3 guys' account got banned because I posted naked women on the Halo Maps forum trying to get people's attention with false advertising. <laughs> and, yeah. But I survived the seven people ban that happened that day whenever CE3 was going on because everyone was flaming us for CE3. They're like, this is a stupid idea, and we're like, oh, no, it's not, just wait for it, and then it happened, and, like, everyone's like, that was actually cool, 
but it sucked because it was me and Drought were like a month. We don't know before. how to no, do We were this. like a month. We were a month before CE3, and we're like, you know what we should do? We should do CE3, and we're like, sure, let's do it, and we do it, and it's shit. <laughs> it was complete shit, and we're like, all right, next year we have to make it better, and then the year after that, we're like, this is actually getting good, and so this is going to be the fourth year of CE3, right? Yes. Uh, yes. All right, that's kind of awesome. I, I think so. We did oh, 10, no, we 11, started 12. In 10. Well, you guys started in oh. I started 12. Yeah, we started in 10. Yeah. We did 11, and then 12. Yeah, this is actually kind of, kind of... I feel old. Oh, my God. I've been in... Four years of CE3, with, and only three years with the Epic Voice guy. I, I think that's why it got better. It's because we got that Epic Voice guy. <laughs> yeah, the Epic Voice guy just makes that's it so good. awesome. I, I actually wish he could be in this podcast, but he's not. We should. Props to Brian Cox. Yeah, this yeah. is that's a plus to Brian Cox. That guy is awesome. He really makes our show. Without him, I feel like our show would still be shit. That's the entire reason. And that is the entire reason. Because whenever you just hear his voice, you're just like, he said my name. <laughs> he said my name. Oh my god. Yeah, and then I just love it. I love it. That's the first one I heard him say my name it, too. It's, Honestly, my favorite line from him is whenever he goes, multiplayer. I'm just like... Ah! <laughs> I really it, want him to do voice tags, like, you know, for, like, oh, Capture the Flag, or Slayer, or Oddball, or something like that. I would I would dig it. I would make a map just around his voice. C3 didn't get better far. because of the editing. It didn't get better because of the streaming. No, it got better because of his voice. Yes, it did. <laughs> And also, I think our humor also evolved. I remember in 2010, we were just like, this is that map, this is this map, here's this map. There were hardly any Machinima portions. No, in, in, 2000, no, in 2010, there were tons of Machinima portions. And then, no, was it 2011 there were Machinima portions? Which one had the most Machinimas? And, you know, the in-between, between each video, 2010 had an opening, as in the only other Machinima parts were the interviews. 2011 was the first year that actually had consistent machinima parts throughout it. Hmm. I know, but we actually had one. I think now we're ramping. At this point, we're ramping. We should stop. We should. All right, well, we're just kind of filling in, letting people know like what happened in the past. That's what we have a YouTube channel. Yeah, as as long as you don't do an hour podcast, you know, like the first 15 minute podcast you did for 20. 20- 12, I, I remember that. I remember that. That was awesome. That was awesome. I love that. I love that. Whatever one. happened to E3PO? I think he's um, dead. I don't know. I think he's dead. I talked to him for a while. He said he got really badly sick. And so I am I sorry to everyone who actually donated. If they didn't get their money back, that was E3PO's. Donation. I don't think anyone did. <laughs> um, I think Darius. Oh no, Darius was actually going to donate. Someone. I think someone did donate like fifteen bucks. That was him. That was him. Yeah, that was E3PO. <laughs> oh, okay, never mind then. I guess no one lost their money. So, yeah, we're not going to do and donations. This is why we don't here. donate anymore. Yeah. <laughs> so we're not Are we having do prizes donation. anymore or no? Yeah, we'll do prizes still because I have a job and Dredd has a girlfriend who he can, like, slave labor on the street and... I'm sorry. <laughs> uh, I'm going to have to kill you. I don't know. <laughs> <laughs> You're dead. Okay, <laughs> I'm dead. Anyway. So, it's just... C3 with just Matthew Dratt and M16 over here. And we're, we're gonna the Flint and Ghost. <laughs> on the stage. I'll bring the epic voice guy as the new host. Get off. No, no, I, don't, I, I think he's only good for announcing. I, I couldn't actually see him as a talkative role. And now, here's Takedown. No. Nope. <laughs> well then, is that it? See what? Yeah, I think so. uh, that's it. That's basically it. So, um, yeah, C3 2013 is happening. Um, please read the rules. Uh, go to all the links. Post. Masters and Dennis, please come this year. This is me begging. I will literally hire you hookers if you come to Vegas. I don't live in Vegas, but I'll be there if you guys come there. We'll have hookers. We'll have cocaine on cookers boobs and we'll be in hot tubs it'll be an awesome thing so just come this year that's my promise to you guys and um yeah the c3 2013 is going to be awesome please tell us that you want to come so we have a new stage better visuals for the editing it's gonna be awesome yes m16 is still streaming 
so it's going to have a good stream, too. No lag. Yeah. We didn't have any lag last year at all. And remember also to download Adblocker Plus. You do not want to sit through those crappy ads about the Olympics. There's no Olympics this Oh, well, there's no yeah. Olympics this year. So you do not want to <laughs> sit through a crappy ad about Dove. No one wants to go through an ad about soap. So anyway, that is all I can think of about this podcast for tonight. More podcasts in the future. Yes, more podcasts. We'll be podcasting like maybe once a month or maybe a couple weeks. Who knows? Whenever we have something to say. Yep. So this has been Slow Bullet. Matthew Drack. M16 Assault. And we are signing off, and we will see you later. Goodbye, people. Love you all. That was an explosion sound. I want an explosion. Bye-bye. Boom! (laughs) Good coffee. (laughs) Yes. And with a cough. (laughs) With a cough. You were being obscenely vulgar this time. It was kind of annoying. Who, me? Yes. I'm sorry that I just said that. I said shit. That was it. Being vulgar, not profane. Oh, uh, with, well, the hookers? Oh, with the hookers. There is nothing wrong with hiring a hooker. <laughs>